Ring, ring. This is Greg. Hey, Greg, this is Sarah Pappas calling. How are you? I'm good. Good. Hey, Greg, I'm actually calling you back here. Um, I've got here in my hands this letter that you had filled out and mailed in for you and Michelle to get some information back on the mortgage protection on your home loan for your house in Florissant Path. Did you fill that out or did maybe uh, Michelle fill that out? I don't know. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, Craig, my, uh, I'm actually I, just the caseworker that's been assigned to get some options together for the two of you. And before okay. I can do that, I actually just needed to verify what was indicated here on the letter. Um, you had put down that your date of birth is uh, March the 3rd, 1964. Is that correct? That is. Okay, very good. And I got Michelle's is May the 7th, 1964. Is that correct? Uh, that's right. All right, very good. And either of you tobacco users or smokers? No. Fantastic. And then, Craig, any major uh, health issues that I should be aware of, like cancer, heart attack, or stroke? No. Great. No, good hearts. Great, great. Any diabetes or COPD? Uh, I have diabetes. Okay, not a problem. Uh, type 2 diabetes? Yeah, um, yeah, just take a little pill. It's okay. not, not a problem. It's under control. Oh, wait, no insulin? Nope. Fantastic. Okay. And does the doctor have either you or Michelle taking any prescription medications for anything else, like high blood pressure or anything? No, no, nothing. No, no more? Okay, fantastic. All right, well, we can work with all of that. Um, according to the letter here, the amount of mortgage to be covered, I've got approximately about 200000 Is that correct? Yeah, it's, yeah, the, the, somewhere, somewhere in there. I don't know. I don't like okay. to think about it. All right, not a problem. Well, um, here's how I got it set up so far is that if something happened to you, Craig, that Michelle would get the mortgage protection benefit and vice versa. Is that how you'd want it? Uh, yeah. Okay. All right. Fantastic. Okay. Well, um, uh, at this point, Craig, I've got enough information to go to work for you here. And so I'm going to go ahead and get some options together for the both of you. And the reason why I wanted to catch you tonight is I'm actually scheduled to be out in your county um, taking care of several of these Monday, Tuesday of this week. So I'm not going to have a lot of time, Greg, but uh, it does take about 15 minutes to go over the coverage options with you and Michelle. And I'd like to try and squeeze you in since I'm going to be out that way anyways. Um, you had indicated here in the letter that you're an air traffic controller. Uh, what time do you typically get home from work in the evenings? Uh, that It'll vary, but some days like 5 o'clock, other days 7. Okay. All right. Well, here, listen, do you want to grab a pen and a piece of paper? I'm going to go and get, get you some information real quick. Okay. And just let me know when you're ready. All right. Do here you, we go. What, do you, what day works better for you, Monday or Tuesday? Uh, Tuesdays are Tuesday? definitely better. Okay. I'm actually going to slip you in. I'll put you in right around like 7, sometime between 7 and 8 o'clock just to be safe. Does that sound okay? Uh, yeah, and you said like 15, 20 minutes? Somewhere around there, so yeah. Okay, around 7 o'clock? Uh, I'm going to come over sometime between 7 and 8. I'm, I've got several folks to see right in your area that night, so you. you just got to give me a little grace on the time. But I'm going to get you down right there. Um, you want to uh, jot down my name? You ready? Okay, yeah. Okay, my name is Sarah. It's S-A-R-A-H. Sarah, all right. And um, put me down next to my name. You can put down Tuesday between 7 and 8 p.m. And do me a huge favor. And if you could just let Michelle know, give her the heads up that I'll be coming by at that time. That way she's not surprised. Okay. Um, the, the only things that I'm going to need from the both of you, if you want to jot this down, I would need to oh, see okay. your prescription medications. So go ahead and have like your... The diabetes. Your, yeah, you take like a metformin or something like that. You can have that out for me to take a quick look at. Uh, we'll need the name of your doctor. And a photo ID, like a driver's license, works just fine. Okay. That's it. You got all that? Yeah. Fantastic. Okay, well, you can look out for me, too, on Tuesday night. Keep the light on for me. Um, I am I drive a, a gold Camry, and looks like I'll be coming to 14524 Fluorescent Path. And is that pretty easy for me to find with my GPS? Yeah. It, uh, I mean, it's new construction, but you just come what, in. What is that off of? What street is that off of? Uh, McEwen. Okay. All right, and what's the name of the neighborhood? Uh, Goldenrod. Okay. Um, all right, very good. And uh, what's the color of your house? Uh, it's actually brick. Okay. All right, very good. And, well, and there's a little bit of siding. I, it's like uh, gray or neutral. Awesome. Okay. All right. Well, I should be able to find that just fine. If not, uh, I'll go ahead and call you at this number. But uh, I've got you down for Tuesday. Uh, sometime between 7 and 8, like I said, just give me a little grace on the time, and we'll get you taken care of as quick as possible. Great. All Thanks. right. Thanks, Craig. We'll see you then. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.